Morning. The sheriff says that students aren't in danger. They are safe when they are going to or from school. But this is something that he wants to address sooner rather than later. A call to help keep kids safe in Clay County. It's not dire straits, but we do need to fill some of the vacancies that we have. In a so, social you know, media message, Sheriff like Daryl Daniels says the sheriff's office is looking for part-time crossing guards to help students get to and from school safely. Right now, the sheriff's office says they are using safety officers until they hire more crossing guards. You know, your kids are not in a position where that, that they're in danger, if you will, for, you know, for uh, their ability or inability to be able to cross the streets. We have folks who will help them do that. And what I don't want to do is put the agency in a position where we're using deputies or pulling deputies from the patrol function and using them. Uh, for crossing guard functions. Earlier this year, a student was hit in front of Clay High School walking across State Road 16. The student was okay, but the school didn't have a crossing guard, and several parents expressed their concerns to News for Jacks. According to the sheriff, elementary and junior high schools are required to have crossing guards. To fill the shortage, they are looking for people in good physical condition, who are dependable and have good communication skills. Some of the duties include monitoring student behavior, reporting traffic violations, and most importantly, making sure students cross when it's safe to do so. As you heard the sheriff men mention, this is not a dire need, but they are urging people to apply if you are looking for part-time work. They do have the job posted on their website, and we have more information on our website, newsforjax.com. Jennifer Eddy, Channel 4, The Local Station.